Good morning, everybody, and welcome back into my home. I bet you all been wondering, where is Ori Spado, the accidental gangster? Well, let me bring you up to date and tell you what I've been doing. Uh, but before I begin, I want to thank all of you who extended your prayers to pray for the Princess of Pomona. Her real name is Lakeisha, very lovely girl with some health issues very serious and she's a young girl so i want to thank you all who have prayed for her and ask you to continue to pray for the princess of pomona folks as you all know that my new book will be coming out it should be available within two to three weeks tops uh, it's going to be available in hardcover which a lot of people have been requesting and it will be available in different bookstores, airports, and, and different places. Uh, so I ask you all to look out for that there. It'll be available on my website, www.theaccidentalgangster.com. Uh, in reference to the podcast, everybody keeps asking me about the podcast. Uh, well, my lawyer gave me help for beginning the podcast without having legal documents. You know, sometimes, you know, I lived a life uh, being a gangster and, you know, we make deals and, you know, and a deal is a deal. We kept our word. That was in that life. That's the life on the streets where we had more trust for each other than there really is in the legitimate world. The legitimate world is so cutthroat today particularly out here in Hollywood. So my lawyer gave me hell. So right now, he's putting the legal documents together for the show. And the show has been changed uh, to The Accidental Gangster with John Fondy. And uh, you're going to love the show. Uh, and soon the show that we have filmed will be uh, published and be put out by Mr. Fondy, and it'll be uh, put on my YouTube, The Accidental Gangster. So you can go to my YouTube soon, and you will see those uh, uh, interviews that we've done, and you're gonna love them. Uh, you know, I talked to you about how life was, and there's a big difference, folks. And last night, for some reason, I awakened to the changes that have happened in my life as a result of writing the book, The Accidental Gangster. Uh, the changes have really been great. And friends that I made through social media, uh, it amazes me. And I wanna thank you all. Uh, you all have a lot of good things to say. And uh, yeah, like, you know, with a good thing, there have been two or three she said bad things, okay? I don't let that bother me. That's going to happen, okay? It happened to Josie Kreese, so obviously it's going to happen to all of us. But the letters that I get from the people that, you know, there's two things in my book that are very important, all right? And I think the most important was my business acumen that I had, the success that I had as a legitimate person. And those are the things I like to dwell on. I had a nice, nice, uh, on Instagram, a gentleman uh, told me how much inspiring my book was and how it's helped him become successful in his life. Those things make me happy. The people, the young men who have read my book and not entered the life or a gang. These are the things I like to hear. And this is why, folks, I'm here for you. If I could help you, you know that I'm there. You could always count on the word of Ori Spado, and I'm always going to tell you the truth. All right? Folks, you all have a great day. And tomorrow I'm going to be back with a little more information. God bless you all.